Hey guys, I'm back. Let's see who this person is. Who is this? For Aries. Who is this? Let's see. Who is this person? Six of Wands could be a Leo individual, somebody that is quite full of themselves here. Um, this could be somebody that feels like they can get anyone they want. Um, all they have to do is lay on some charm, okay? Yep. All they have to do is lay on some charm. Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy here. Tell you what you want to hear. Play on your emotions. Be careful. Knight of Wands, somebody that is kind of flaky. And I can definitely see that here. This is not a king, guys. This is somebody that I feel like that is possibly an opportunist that uses their looks, their charm, um, to, to try to gain your trust and get what they want from you. I feel like this is somebody that comes in and out of your life time and time again. You know exactly who this person is. Okay. Then we have Taurus energy and then they leave. This could be somebody that is trying to um, make you think that they are different and that they're here to, here to stay. But this person will do this to you again. If you allow them back in, I feel like this is somebody that will um, leave you high and dry. They will leave you in a lurch and possibly take your money. Okay? <clears throat> Yeah, stand-up character. Eight of Cups here. I feel like this is somebody that's come back to you. Piscean energy. And they really want your attention so very badly. Of course, this is somebody that has walked away. We've established that this person's very flaky in and out. Um, but I feel like this person is currently back in your life. And um, I don't know if you're allowing them to wreak havoc in it or not. Six of Swords here. Hmm. I feel like you guys know exactly who this is. And I feel like they have... Maybe you've tried to help this person. Um, I feel like this person is leaving someone else or leaving another place. and um, Or has left this place and come back towards you. And I think that they're pulling at your heartstrings here. Maybe they've had some hard times. Maybe they've been put out from a house or kicked out of a relationship or what have you. But I feel like an opportunist energy here, Aquarius, is here now. Hmm. Then we have a Nine of Pentacles. If this person has ever told you that they want a relationship, I don't feel like this person is um, relationship ready. I actually feel like they're a commitment foe. I do feel like they prey on people's emotions. Um, they, they try to find a, a spot where they can like maneuver into. And um, yeah. They take advantage of situations for their own benefit. Because at the end of the day, I feel like this person is full of themselves. Card that's out front and center here first is a Six of Wands energy. Okay. We have Virgo energy here too. So Leo, Virgo, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Taurus, um, Pisces, and Aquarius energy is present here. Um... I don't really feel like this person is wanting to commit, even if they told you this. But I, I'm feeling like you guys are seeing through this guise with this person. Then we have a King of Swords. Hmm. I feel like there's also somebody here that is wanting to come back your way another person 
Taurus Gemini. I feel like like this energy over here is kind of separate. And um, there's somebody else that I feel like maybe some of you lived with at one point in time that left the situation that hurt you. And I feel like that person's still here. I feel like they're coming back in. Um, there's something very mature about this other person though. Very kind of like non-emotional. Definitely does not wear their heart on their sleeve. I don't feel like this person tries to swoon you whatsoever with emotions. I feel like this person is more financially stable than the other person. Hmm. There's like a competition here. What does this person really want with Aries? Nine of Swords to just fuck up your world. Somebody, I feel like this person is is wanting to like mess with your head a little bit. Maybe even make you feel sorry for them. Let your guard down here. The Eight of Wands here. This person feels like they're a smooth talker. They want to keep you from moving forward, moving on. One of these wants to keep you from moving on. I feel like one is one to really fuck with you. Because <laughs> there's something about this Leo Virgo like energy um, that wants to keep you like, I don't know, they want to fuck with you. But the other person I, I'm feeling like wants to keep you from moving on. I'm feeling like this other person is probably going to reach out to you if they haven't already. Three of Wands there. I think you're expecting this. I think you're expecting some sort of communication from this other person. I think you're definitely expecting it. Um, this person, I feel like this other one over here has been looking for you guys to reach out to them. Because maybe that has been the standard that has been the situation that you guys have always like reached out to them. Here. King of Pentacles. This, this other person over here is looking for stability from you. They're looking for stability from you. Um, there, there's something in their little warped thought processes that um, makes them feel like they want to be there for you. They want to be with you. I don't see them coming here as a king, though. Their actions, their, their emotional maturity is, is limited. Um, but I see them wanting to have some kind of financial gain by being with you guys. Um, I'm feeling like this person is, is trying to manipulate your, your thoughts and manipulate your emotions to get what it is that they want. This is more like an opportunist energy over here. Um, I'm not sure what the situation is with this person, honestly. Let me pull out my, um, trusty old Kipper cards here. I'm still getting familiar with these so we're gonna see what comes up and if I have to read for you guys I definitely will okay this says false person and they're upside down these cards so this is false person I'm looking right at the king of swords here I feel like this is somebody that deceived you before this is somebody who um, put on a certain face for you and made you feel comfortable and then basically sucker punched you. I feel like this is somebody that left. This King of Swords. 